Is it funny or does it take things too far? That's what many are asking after looking at a Facebook fan page called The Creatures of Lorraine County. Well, I never go to sites like that because I'm not really interested in small-minded people. Users submit photographs of people in Lorraine County and then fans unleash their comments. The page has more than 800 pictures since it launched in April. Some of it was kind of funny, but at the end of the day, it's like almost adult bullying. But some of its 19,000 fans can't get enough. On one post, a user says, I spent most of my trip there today looking out the windows hoping to get the next creature. Thank you for your continuing entertainment. A Fox 8 viewer recently contacted us when a relative was featured on the web page and her relative happens to be mentally handicapped. Now that family did not want to go on camera. I spoke to the Creatures of Lorraine County founder Amy Clark on the phone. She says the picture was taken down and the site does not target any group just bad clothing choices. We love every picture we get. Our repeat offenders, we love them. We had one old woman that had, you know, pink hair. We love her. Like, we want to meet you. If they don't like what someone's wearing, they shouldn't judge them. Maybe they should try to help them. Now, Facebook has a no-tolerance policy for bullying, and if a person ever harasses you in an online post or picture, you can report it. Clark says the page gets its share of negative feedback, but they only post things found in public. And if you find a picture in bad taste, they may take it down. She's even posted pictures of herself. I was covered from head to toe in mud, you know, and I blurred out my cat's face because I didn't want my cat to, you know, come back and sue me, you know, just a joke. Like, it's all for just fun and entertainment. We're not meaning, you know, anything bad by it. In Lorraine County and at Lawless, Fox 8 News.